UBC's home to the Thunderbirds, Blue Chip Cookies, and the UBC. But did you know it's also home to the world's largest cyclotron? I'm Sarah Chow, and welcome to Triumph. What is a cyclotron? So a cyclotron is a particle accelerator, and it accelerates particles in a spiral. It does that both in electric and in magnetic fields. And it does that based on the shape of the magnet, and then also how we use the electric field. In our accelerator, we accelerate hydrogen ions, and that is hydrogen with an extra electron added onto it. That gives it a charge, which means that we can affect it with the magnetic and electric field. As you can see behind me, the cyclotron has a really interesting shape. And if you look at our logo, that's actually the inspiration for our logo. How does a cyclotron accelerate particles? This is the inside of what a cyclotron looks like. This is a one-tenth scale model. And so what happens is that the hydrogen ion comes in the center, and it has a negative charge. It comes in and half of this, called a D, will be positively charged and the negative ion goes towards it and then the magnet steers it around and when it reaches this gap the polarity is flipped. So this becomes negative, that becomes positive and they just accelerate in this little gap and then it goes around at a constant speed, the polarity is flipped, the hydrogen ion is attracted to the positive side again, it goes around at a constant speed, it flips, it accelerates and it just keeps doing this. This is enough times that it gets accelerated to three quarters of the speed of light in less than a second. Due to the sheer size of the cyclotron, the majority of the parts need to be made in-house. Another cool thing you can do at Triumph is balance paper clips on your hand. We're standing on top of the cyclotron. Um, and to run the cyclotron properly, we need to make sure that we have the magnetic fields turned on. Our giant magnets are turned on and they're creating a strong magnetic field. Um, you can see that, you can see my little paper clip is wobbling back and forth, standing up on its own. So that indicates the field is on. Um, it's very important because we're accelerating things in a spiral and we can't keep them in a spiral. They want to go in a straight line if we have no magnets. So come out and visit Triumph. You can check out their schedules at triumph.ca. I'm Sarah Chow for the UBC.